We begin with the spate of insecurity in the country. Gunmen who abducted worshippers at a Catholic church in Kajuru, Kaduna State, are now demanding a ransom of at least 100 million naira. This before the kidnapped worshippers will be freed. The traditional leader of Angwan Fada in Kajuru Local Government Council, Elisha Mari, revealed this to TVC News when heads of security agencies and a Kaduna government delegation visited the area to assess the situation. He also revealed that he was among those who were initially kidnapped by the gun-wielding terrorists before who stormed their villages on more than 30 motorcycles. He further explained that it took them about two hours before they arrived at the bandits' camp where the hostages were kept. According to him, he was freed because he is the traditional leader but was asked to raise at least 100 million naira ransom before those in captivity would be freed. Another eyewitness, Bashir Usman, stated that the three persons who were killed made attempts to repel the terrorists. This attack also comes barely two weeks after the Kaduna government confirmed that at least 32 people were killed by armed terrorists who invaded four communities in Kajuru local government area of the state.